game. We are here at MSI 2021. MSI always feels to me like the tournament where surprises are more likely to happen, where the result is not as set in stone. It's Arya picking up the kill, it's killing spree there on the side for the mid laner. Evie finds another on to Blaver here as well, and now Fudge has been shut down, and truly everyone on C9 is dead. They tried to play for the soul, but all they got was a single kill. We had some good moments in the game, but unfortunately they were just too strong. The fact that Detonation are actually coming in here and challenging the world champion in this manner. Farfetch, the immediate hook, the immediate fall up there. There's no cleanse for the Blitzcrank. He gets it. dropped in an instant. Now they're trying to finish oh. it. Udyr manages to grab it. Baird in the pit. Shockwave hits two. Zaren's going to get one back. It's an absolute bloodbath. My God, but BRTT again where he needs to be. First one, they turn their attention to the second. It starts to get chunked down. Pain Gaming get lost. Ditto. They go to the devil. Oh. Mad Lions live. Mad Lions are going to charge it straight back at Pain. In the blink of an eye, I think this game's over. And this group just got a whole lot more interesting. Way is down. Praetor's going to be traded back here with a one for one in this extended fight. Chaz trying to escape. Zhao who follows it up, grabs the damage. Four to two game for RNG. RNG are uh, not taking it easy on this group. Cody on a tear. That's a double kill. And Bogax back for a little bit of revenge. The triple for Cody. He's looking to finish the job. That's the slow. Does not connect on the Gnar. Unipon running for his life. The heal to take him out to safety. But it is too little. It is too late. That is the shutdown for Gillette Infinity. Pentanet GG up against Unicorns of Love. Lodic's going to be taken down first. Bio Panther grabbing the kill. Adonasic dead next. It is three Unicorns in the dirt. Endangered space. He's about to go extinct. And there is no way for anybody on the side of Unicorns to love to take him down. Heard y'all were talking shit. What you gotta say now? They leave him alive just to let him watch the Nexus fall. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what an incredible showing here from the European team. Absolutely dismantling PSG talent. Perks has taken it, slain it, and Boogax from a mile away gets deleted. Out Nine's first win at MSI 2021 against Infinity. Showmaker gonna be forced away, holding onto that flash as long as he can. One more tick to cue the flash out, but Kanye stole the dragon. People punish you way more internationally. If you start to lose a fight against Dan Wonkia, they are just going to keep beating you in that fight. This rumble stage is very, very interesting. Gala is right behind him and will rain the plasma down on the Tristana. RNG will take down the world champions in game one of the rumble stage. Everyone diving on in to try and kill Xiaohu, who is going to be able to get some back. But PSG are going to do it. They defeat the undefeatable, and RNG will draw blood for the first time at MSI 2021. Kryon is still alive. The mid laner for RNG will finally go down, but at the cost of the entire C9 lineup. They don't need to beat you in a 5v5. They'll outthink you. RNG takes the game. It's been a long time since we've had an EU versus NA battle. The backstep, the mounting dread is not quite enough damage. The flash in, the damage, the autos, they're enough. Humanoid, he still lives. This is heartbreaking for C9. They're so oh. close, but they just get outplayed at every opportunity. Say it with me, EU. El Yoya, El Yoya, El Yoya. We are not maybe the greatest players as individually, but as a team, I think we are really one of the top teams. I think that a lot of teams are going to stand up and recognize that this team has come to play. Kaiser's gonna be targeted now, taken very low. Nor looking for the damage, it's a double kill over to Doggo, but Karzy is resetting. Holy Karzy, baby! Triple kill for the Mad Lions, and he gets it done! As the Ignite's now ticking down, the last tick will do it, and Barrel picks up the kill in the end. Look at the excitement! That's joy right there! Pentanet is not looking for dessert, they send Fudge home! I was calling the whole time, the whole tournament, that there is no way PGG goes 0-10. They're gonna have to win against somebody, well it's not be us, but it was us in the end. Anything we learn, it's all towards like the ultimate goal of like worlds. Hello and welcome to the MSI 2021 semi-finals. RNG are still the favorites to win MSI 2021. 
Maple gonna flash follow, and that's a stun right away. Absolutely no way out for Cryon. Shockwave, flash chase, first blood for PSG Talon. Sitting there by the blast plane, wants to go in, gonna get stunned up though. What's the engage gonna look like? They just shut down the jungler, but is the re-engage gonna look good? Roll over the top, Gala is attacked and shut down, but is Elder Dragon enough? That is the question. Mega Knight to the wall, Shockwave back in, the shutdown comes across, Ming is low, but there aren't enough teammates left for PSG. RNG are headed to the finals, waiting for their opponent on Sunday. Can they win their second ever international trophy? There's nothing you can do. RNG are your nightmare. Boys, boys, boys. Don't forget about armor. Mad Lions up against Dom One Kia. They take the whole damn mile. A clean ace for Dom One as they only lose Ghost. And with a triple kill, Canyon has stamped his name on this game. For the GA has popped on armor. The Nexus Towers are falling, and Mad Lions may have done it. But right now, Humanoid is next on the menu for Dom One. Humanoid and Armut are dead. Mad Lions, their pride is hurt and perhaps the game is over. Dom One Kia are the oncoming storm. And they will face off, you have to feel, against RNG in the finals. Dom One Kia are unstoppable. Welcome to the MSI 2021 Finals between Dom Juan Kia and RNG. Stopwatch also ready there for the follow-up as now they'll find themselves another kill. Three dead on the side of RNG. Still five seconds before Cryon's able to come back. Ghost says, get out of my game! Ace for Dom Juan. They will push the Nexus turrets. RNG have decided to initiate. Barrel goes over the wall. He's already down. Showmaker's going to drop here. Next con's going to be the third to die. RNG with a massive amount of cleanup here so far. Gala goes over the wall. Canyon's going to be the last man standing. RNG destroy Dom Juan Kia. Gala wiping him off the map. Oh, they're trying to go back in. Ming leads the charge. Canyon with a nice stasis, keeping himself alive, but it's going to be a one-for-one one trade. Khan has joined the fight. Ghost is going in. Shadow's going down. Cryon's about to die. Quadra kill. One, two, three, four, five. It's Dom Juan Kia, and it's Ghost to save the day. Showmaker is down. They're going to pick up the second on the canyon. They'll continue pushing forward. Dom Juan is not long for this world. Everybody is dropping dead right in front of our eyes. And RNG is going forward. Cryon goes after the enemy AD carry, but he's not able to find them. Canyon will die first. RNG, they're on the Nexus. Dom Juan has no ability to stop this. It's game over. The LPL are kings again. The RNG era is here once more. From going last year, not even making playoffs in summer, to reaching the highest heights that the RNG organization has ever reached before is incredible. What a performance from RNG.